In this video, we're gonna talk about the 99 names of Allah and what they mean. So before starting this video, like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel for future updates. The first pillar of Iman, faith in Islam, is belief in Allah. As Muslims, they believe in Allah in accordance with His beautiful names and attributes. Allah has revealed His names repeatedly in the Holy Quran, primarily for them to understand who he is. Learning and memorizing the names of Allah will help them to identify the correct way to believe in him. There is nothing more sacred and blessed than understanding the names of Allah and living by them. How does someone expect to worship, love, fear, and trust the Lord, the Almighty Allah, if they don't know who he is? Allah says in the Quran, and to Allah belongs the best names, so invoke him by them. Quran 7, 180. Allah, there is no deity except Him. To Him belong the best names. Quran 28. He is Allah, the creator, the inventor, the fashioner. To Him belong the best names. Quran 59, 24. Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, said, Allah has 99 names, 100 minus 1, and whoever knows them will go to paradise. Sahih Bukhari 50, 894. Abu Huraira reported Allah's Messenger, peace be upon him, as saying, There are 99 names of Allah. He who commits them to memory would get into paradise. Verily, Allah is odd. He is one, and it's an odd number. And he loves odd number. Sahih Muslim Book 48, Hadith 5. Here are the 99 names of Allah and their meanings. Ar-Rahman, the Beneficent, He who wills goodness and mercy for all his creatures. Ar-Rahim, the merciful, he who acts with extreme kindness, al-Malik, the king, the sovereign lord, the one with complete dominion, the one whose dominion is clear from imperfection, al-Qudus, the most sacred, the most holy, the one who is pure, so far removed of any imperfection, he has no shortcomings, evil is not attributed to him, as-Salam, the giver of peace, the one who is free from every imperfection, it's because he is free from any defect that one who is with him experiences tranquility. Al-Mumin, the infuser of faith, the one who witnessed for himself that no one is God but him, and he witnessed for his believers that they are truthful in their belief that no one is God but him. al muhaymin the guardian, the one who witnesses the saying and deeds of his creatures. al muhaymin Al-Aziz, the mighty one, the strong, the defeater, who is not defeated. Al-Jabbar, the all-compelling, the one that nothing happens in his dominion except that which he willed. Al-Mutaqabir, the dominant one, the one who is clear from the attributes of the creatures and from resembling them. Al-Khaliq, the creator, the one who brings everything from non-existence to existence. Al-Bari, the evolver, the maker, the maker, the creator, who has the power to turn the entities. Al-Musavir, the flawless shaper, the one who forms his creatures in different pictures. al ghafar the great forgiver, the forgiver, the one who forgives the sins of his slaves time and time again. al qahar the all-prevailing one, the dominant, the one who has the perfect power and is not unable over anything. al wahhab the supreme bestower, the one who is generous in giving plenty without any return. He is everything that benefits whether halal or haram. al razak the total provider, the sustainer, the provider, Al-Fatah, the opener, the solver, the reliever, the judge, the one who opens for his slaves the closed worldly and religious matters, Al-Alim, the all-knowing one, the knowledgeable, the one nothing is absent from his knowledge, Al-Qabid, the restricting one, the constrictor, the withholder, the one who constricts the sustenance by his wisdom and expands and widens it with his generosity and mercy, al Basid the extender, the enlarger, the one who constricts the sustenance by his wisdom and expands and widens it with his generosity and mercy. al khafid the reducer, the abaser, the one who lovers whoever he wills by his destruction and raises whoever he wills by his endowment. Al-Rafi, the elevating one, the exalter, the elevator, the one who lovers whoever he wills by his destruction and raises whoever he wills by his endowment. al muiz the honorer bestrower. He gives esteem to whoever he willed, hence there is no one to degrade him, and he degrades whoever he willed, hence there is no one to give him esteem. al mozil the abaser, the dishonorer, the humiliator. He gives esteem to whoever he willed, 
hence there is no one to degrade him, and he degrades whoever he wilt, hence there is no one to give him esteem. Asami, the all hearer, the hearer, the one who hears all the things that are heard by his eternal hearing without an ear, instrument or organ. Al-Basir, the all-seeing, the all-noticing, the one who sees all things that are seen by his eternal seeing without a pupil or any other instrument. Al-Hakam, the impartial judge, the judge, he is the ruler and the judge, he is the ruler and his judgment in his word, his judgment is his word. Al-Adr, the embodiment of justice, the just, the one who entitled to do what he does. Al-Latif, the knower of subtleties, the subtle one, the gracious, the one who is gone to his slaves and endows upon them. Al-Kabir, the all-aware one, the one who knows the truth of things. Al-Halim, the clement one, the forbearing, the one who delays the punishment for those who deserves it, and then he might forgive them. Al-Azim, the magnificent one, the great one, the mighty, the one deserving the attributes of exaltment, glory, extolment, the purity from all imperfection. Al-Ghafur, the all-forgiving, the all-forgiving, the forgiving, the one who forgives a lot. Al-Shakur, the acknowledging one, the grateful, the appreciative, the one who gives a lot of reward for a little obedience. Al-Ali, the sublime one, the most high, the one who is clear from the attributes of the creatures. Al-Kabir, the great one, the most great, the great, the one who is greater than everything in status. Al-Hafiz, the guarding one, the preserver, the protector, the one who protects whatever and whoever he will to protect. Al-Muqid, the sustaining one, the maintainer, the guardian, the feeder, the one who has the power. Al-Hasib, the reckoning one, the reckoner, the one who gives the satisfaction. Al-Jalil, the majestic one, the sublime one, the beneficent, the one who is attributed with greatness of power and glory of status. Al-Karim, the bountiful one, the generous one, the gracious, the one who is attributed with greatness of power and glory of status. Al-Raqib, the watchful one, the watcher, the one that nothing is absent from him. Hence, its meaning is related to attribute of knowledge. Al-Mujib, the responding one, the responsive, the hearkener, the one who answers the one in need if he asks him, and rescue the yearned if he calls upon him. al wasi the all-pervading one, the wast, the all-embarrassing, the knowledgeable. Al-Hakim, the wise one, the wise, the judge of judges, the one who is correct in his doings. Al-Wadud, the loving one, the most loving, the most affectionate, the beloved. Al-Majid, the glorious one, the most glorious one, the one who is with perfect power, high status, compassion, generosity, and kindness. al bayis the infuser of new life, the awakener, resurrector, arouser. al shahid the all-observing witness, the witness, the one who nothing is absent from him. al haq the embodiment of truth, the truth, the true, the one who truly exists. al waqil the universal trustee, the trustee, the one who gives the satisfaction and is relied upon. al kavi the strong one, the most strong, the strong, the one with complete power. al matin the firm one, the one with extreme power, which is uninterrupted and he does not get tired. al valiya the protecting associate, the protecting friend, the supporter. Al-Hamid, the sole laudable one, the praiseworthy, the praised one who deserves to be praised. Al-Muhsi, the all-enumerating one, the counter, the reckoner, the one who the count things are known to him. al mubti the originator, the one who started the human being, that is, he created him. al muid the restorer, the reproducer, the one who brings back the creatures after death. al muhi the maintainer of life, the restorer, the giver of life. al mumid the inflictor of death, the creator of death, the destroyer, the one who renders the living dead. al hay the eternally living one, the alive, the one attributed with a life that is unlike our life and is not that of a combination of soul, flesh, or blood. Al-Qayyum, the self-subsisting one, the self-subsisting, the self-existing one upon whom all others depend. Al-Wajid, the pointing one, the perceiver, the finder, the rich, who is never poor. Al-Wajid is richness. Al-Majid, the all-noble one, the glorious, he who is most glorious. Al-Wahid, the one and only, the unique, the one, the one without a partner, Al-Ahad, 
the sole one, the one, as-samad, the supreme provider, the eternal, the independent, the master who is relied upon in matters and reverted to in one's needs. He is the only one a person should turn to when feeling helpless. Al-Qadir, the omnipotent one, the able, the capable, the one attributed with power. Al-Muqtadir, the all-authoritative one, the powerful, the dominant, the one with the perfect power that nothing is withheld from him. Al-Muqaddim, the expecting one, the expeditor, the promoter, the one who puts things in their right places. Al-Muakhir, the procrastinator, the delayer, the one who puts things in their right places. He makes ahead what he wills and delays what he wills. Al-Awal, the wary first, the first, the one whose existence is without a beginning. Al-Akhir, the infinite last one, the last, the one whose existence is without an end. Al-Zahir, the perceptible, the manifest, the conspicuous, the evident. al bathin the imperceptible, the hidden, the secret one, the inner one, the knower of hidden things. Al-Wali, the holder of supreme authority, the governor, the one who owns things and manages them. Al-Muthali, the extremely exalted one, the most exalted, the highly exalted, the one who is clear from the attributes of the creation. Al-Bar, the fountainhead of truth, the source of all goodness, righteous, the one who is kind to his creatures. At-Tawab, the ever acceptor of repentance, the acceptor of repentance, the oft forgiving, the acceptor of our return. Al-Muntaqim, the retailer, the avenger, the disapprover, the inflictor of retribution. Al-Afu, the supreme partner, the partner, the forgiver, the eliminator of sins. Al-Rauf, the benign one, the most kind, the tenderly merciful, the clement and compassionate. Malikul Mulk, the eternal possessor of sovereignty the one who controls the dominion and gives dominion to whoever he willed. Dil Jalal wal Ikram, the possessor of majesty and honor, the lord of majesty and bounty. Al Muqsid, the just one, the equitable, the one who is just in his judgment. Al Jami, the assembler of scattered creatures. The gatherer, the one who gathers the creatures on a day that there is no doubt about, that is the day of judgment. Al Ghani, the self-sufficient one, the one who does not need the creation. al mughni the bestower of sufficiency, the enricher, the one who satisfies the necessities of the creature. Al-Mani, the preventer, the withholder. Ad-Dar, the distresser, the corrector, the balancer, the distresser, the afflictor, the punisher. Al-Nafi, the bestower of benefits, the creator of good, the benefitor, the propitious, the auspicious, an the prime light, the light, the one who guides, Al-Hadi, the provider of guidance, the guide, the leader, the guide of the right path, Al-Badi, the unique one, the wonderful originator, the unprecedented and incomparable inventor, Al-Baqi, the ever-surviving one, the everlasting, the ever-enduring, the ever-present, Al-Waris, the eternal inheritor, the here, the one whose existence remains, Al Rashid, the guide to path of rectitude, the guide to the right path, the one who guides. As Sabur, the extensively enduring one, the patient, the one who does not quickly punish the sinners. What do you think about this video? Do let us know down in the comment section below. If you enjoyed the video and want to hear from us again, be sure to hit the subscribe button before you go.